The deadly attacks in Paris hit close to home for many in New Hampshire. A couple of vigils were held today to remember the victims and pray for peace. WMER's Mike Cronin joins us live now in the studio with the outpouring of love for those who died Friday. This afternoon, a couple dozen gathered at a French park in Nashua to reflect on what happened. And tonight at St. Anselm College, students were together in thought and prayer, shocked by the brutality of what happened in Paris. Through song and prayer, St. Anselm College honors Paris, the city of light. People appreciate a common celebration to both reflect together, but also to turn to God, to turn to the higher power. More than 100 students came together for a candlelight vigil on campus to remember the victims of the Paris terrorist attacks. At the school's Sunday night mass, the horrific events in Paris weighed heavy on people's minds. The care and compassion we have for those who have been harmed, um, <laughs> and that's what I've been trying to emphasize. <laughs> Earlier in the day, people sang the French national anthem and showed support for Paris at Nashua's Le Parc de Notre Renaissance Francaise. The English translation is the Park of Our French Renewal. So many people around the world are uh, stating, Je suis Paris, je suis France. And it's, it's so nice. Eric Drewart, who's from France, has family living in the area where the attacks happened. These people are really attacking the, the whole civilized world. And we're very familiar with the area. So it's quite sad, you know, sad for the families that have lost their loved ones. Back in Manchester, students remember all those affected by the senseless act. Nashua will continue to remember the victims in Paris this week as the city will fly a French flag outside of City Hall and President Obama ordered all American flags fly at half-staff tomorrow. Reporting live in the studio, Mike Cronin, WMUR News 9.